So what's going on everybody? This is Chaotic BPR here. Just want to give you a few updates of what's going on with BPX standalone and answer some questions that I had in some comments. Uh, for instance, this question right here was, do the VPX tables save your high scores? And in the, uh, there it is right there, BPR 230 million. Uh, let it continue on. And there's a previous high score I did of 158 million. So yes, it does. These BPX tables do save your high scores. Uh, some of them, they're, they allow us to do custom uh, high scores, but this is built to, like, this is one of the uh, Williams tables. So it has a ROM. Tables that don't have ROM, you know, we can make our own uh, high score uh, stuff like that. And it does save, but ones with ROMs, that has to be saved into what's called NV RAM. Uh, that gets saved. So when I exit this table, give me just a second. And go back into it. Let it load up here and everything. And I'll show you that when the DMD pops back up and it starts going through its uh, motions, when it goes to the high scores, my high score should, I should still be grand champion. And I should have a third place score as well. So just give it a second to load here. And we do have that serum color DMD. You do not have to have that. But since I got a colored version of this table and the black and white version, I wanted to use the color DMD for this one and the black and white DMD for the other one. So, all right. So let it go through its DMD motions real quick. Grand champion, there I am. So you saw me exit the table, get back into it. My high score, I'm still grand champion. I'm also still number three in the Hall of Fame. So that should answer your question right then and there that yes, the VPX tables do save your high scores. Now I had some other requests for tables just to see how they play, how they look. Uh, Ray Del Torre, you want to see Funhouse? Let me show you Funhouse. Let me turn off my uh, topper so you can see the play field really good. I know that camera shows a lot of reflections, so. Yeah, man. Funhouse runs. Um, the The good news is the uh, ROM has it set to free play, so you don't even have to put coins in or anything. You can just hit play. And sink all your balls and hit play again and hit play again. Um, this particular version that I'm testing has a blue uh, DMD, which is weird. But um, there is other versions out there. This one currently runs at 35 frames per second. Um, I didn't have to do any of the uh, op. The, the person that uploaded this t this particular table um, had to go through extra steps and read me. I wanted it to be as easy as possible, so I chose a different version of this table. And this one came with a blue blue DMD, but as you can see, Ray, it it plays good, my man. Well, hard as shit, but it plays good. So yeah, I know Funhouse was requested by a lot of people. Oh damn, terrible. Well, this ain't about my skills. This is just to show y'all that the progress on these tables and the progress of uh, the standalone and everything is working really well. Damn. Screwed myself up. Yeah, terrible score. <laughs> this thing is set to free play, so I can hit play right now. And boom. I don't even have to put in, I don't even have to put in more imaginary coins and I can just hit play. Uh... There you go. It also doesn't help that I've got a camera in my face.
Ding 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 ding. Whoop. I thought we were fucked. Rudy always messing with you. All right, another person in my comments asked. Uh, apparently, he owned this table in real life, and want to know if we can get it on VPX. Old Coney Island from 1979. Game plan. So. Yes, man, we can do it. Uh, the good news is it comes with a ROM. So it has some of the sound effects. And you can actually change in the script to add or, you know, add more sound effects that the real table had. Um, <laughs> boom. Yeah. So uh, put some coins in. There we go. This particular table, my man, runs at 60 frames per second. It's good to see, like, classic tables like this, too. I actually, I actually like this table. So hopefully this makes you happy, man, to see that this table's on here. Um, I haven't uploaded it to the GitHub yet. Because uh, I wanted to do some additional testing. But. You see it's here. Oh, damn. Oh, it gave me another shot. How about that? Isn't that nice? Oh. Yeah. Cool. So yeah, man, just wanted to show you that. Hey, old Coley Island's here, man, and it works. Looks good, I hope. So hopefully it looks like you remember it from the real one and everything. So wanted to bring a lot of classic tables for a lot of people in the community that really, really wanted some of these uh, tables that, you know, everybody wants Williams, everybody wants Data East and Stern, but what about the older stuff, the stuff that really just paved the way for uh, classic uh, pinball, you know? Uh, Phantom of the Opera, 1990 Data East as well. Um, I got to upload that into the repo, but she is looking good too. Oh, and I'm going to make sure I tag the people in this in this video description to make sure y'all know that, hey, uh, I did answer some of y'all's questions on some of these tables that y'all were asking about. Either see a demo of... I am a of the opera. Oh, man, this thing looks so good. Now, no DMD because the DMD is actually up here on the back glass and everything, but that back glass is interactive. It lights up and stuff. This table runs at 40 frames per second right now. It could improve. Great use of SSF kit as well. I'm still learning this table. I'm trying to get the nuances about it. I got the volume kind of low, but. Oh yeah. Oh shit, I opened the trap door and I got, I got. <laughs> I opened the trap door and I got a. Uh, I got distracted. Oh, it's back open again. Hold on. Let me see if I can get it in there. I actually never did that in my testing yet. Let's see if I can get it in there. Beep. Uh oh. Okay. It's a ball lock. Okay. That's what that is. Oh, it's back open again. Oh, 
no. We already got multi ball. Magic mirror. Crap. Magic mirror. Extra ball. Look at there. Boom. We already done some stuff. Classic, dude. This is awesome. This was uh, highly requested from a lot of people to see running on this machine, and it's running the SSF kit really, really, really good. So glad to bring this to y'all. She's blood curdling. Ladies and gentlemen, we have Robocop. Robocop. Very cool table. I love the lighting effects. Again, SSF kit on this is really good too. Like I'm really impressed. You are under arrest. Good stuff, man. Shoot Ed oh not Ed, Ed two oh nine. Oh, can't do it. But y'all get the gist, man. So you are under arrest. I hope y'all are super happy with some of the progress that's going on. I know there was concern from a lot of people saying that uh you know, they've been checking the repo, they've been checking the GitHub and seeing that, you know, it seems like new tables are stalling. It's not about that. Um, we got plenty of tables that we're still testing and still working on. The thing is, though, we are trying, what we're doing now is now that we have over 300 tables available for everybody, we want to make sure that all the instructions are clear, that they are easy to follow. And some of that is not even going to matter anymore once the wizard comes out. And I haven't had a chance to see the wizard yet other than a couple screenshots. But once Nix gets that ready, gets that done, um, a lot of that stuff is going to be pretty much streamlined for you guys. So, But we want to make sure that we have all the readme files completely correct. Like the table preview shows up like it's supposed to. The will art is there. Um, all the the uh, all the instructions leading to the download files. Make sure all those links work. So if you think about it, if we got over three hundred something tables, we all now have to go through and make sure all those links work and make sure uh, that those tables are um, linking to the correct VPX file as well as the backlash file and the ROM. So yeah. We got to do a lot of that stuff, but now we're at a good point where we got plenty of tables to play with. Y'all have plenty of tables to play with. Now it's about making sure the instructions are correct, making sure that we didn't, you know, copy and paste the wrong uh, web address to the wrong file, and that we make sure we gave the correct credit to the correct correct creator of these tables so it's all about cler uh, clerical work and making sure you know we got our ducks in a row before we actually start getting ready for this wizard to be launched by nix and for all y'all to be able to start playing uh we want to make sure we gave the right people the right uh you know the right creators the right you know you know what I'm trying to say, guys. So we would just want to make sure everything's right and everybody's happy. Um, so it's coming down to the wire that we're getting everything done. So hopefully you guys are super happy with what y'all have seen. Um, but 
I will post some more videos shortly, hopefully, of uh, some more shorts, of uh, some more tables. If y'all got any more requests, please let me know, and I will try to post as much as I can. Uh, until then, guys, I'm going to play some more pinball, so I will see y'all in the next video. Thank y'all so much for coming by. If you're not a subscriber, please hit the subscribe button for more, especially if you're interested in the VPX standalone stuff. And for you people who stop by this video, hey, if you like it, hit the like button, my man. And make sure you hit the notification bell for more stuff coming in the future. So, guys, I'm going to enjoy some more pinball. Y'all have a good one.